Hey there guys and gals, and welcome to as a bonus episode of Let's Play Silent Hill 2 3, Silent Hill 3, um, where I'm going to show off a very weird extra costume. Um, to get it, you've got to clear the game, and in the extra costumes, type in Princess Heart, which I am doing right now. It's really fucking hard to do this. <laughs> Oh, there we go. And enter. And we have the transform costume. Which is a very fun costume. Oh god, it's so fun. <laughs> anyway, extra new game. I'm just gonna fucking put it easy because I'm not even intending to play it. I only want to get past the first few cutscenes and just show off this very weird and very str just totally strange outfit that they decided to add in. Um, I'm pretty sure it was just for comic relief, basically. Hey, look, she's already wearing it. That's not fair. That's not fair. Okay, let's let's just fucking skip these cutscenes. <laughs> That's not fair. I want to fucking put it on. Now I'm going to take it off and put it back on. Fuck that shit. <laughs> Fuck all y'all. Um, just gonna fucking go down here. This is where you get the unlimited submachine gun. Um, might as well just pick it up. Show it off. I'm also gonna fucking. Okay, so if you unlock the transform costume, uh, you can equip and unequip it at any time by selecting the transform costume uh, wand. And I'm just gonna fucking play with this unlimited submachine gun for just a little minute. Just to show you how it is. Anyway. That is how you use the unlimited submachine gun. You use it like a dopey mad woman. Run, Hannah, run! Or should I call her Usagi? Usagi is the um, Japanese name for Sailor Moon, for those who don't know, which would be totally weird, because I'm pretty sure a lot of people who watch Sailor Moon, or at least watched, know that. Okay, so let's get ready for transformation. It's so fucking weird! <laughs> anyway... Um... One, please empower! Makeup! Anyway, yeah, so... Thanks for watching this very weird bonus episode where I show off the Princess Heart costume because I just love the fucking weird thing. Uh, I suppose I might as well also show off the other weapon I got that I unlocked anyway for um, killing God with a melee weapon. Killing God with a... Uh, uh, ranged weapon, like your guns, um, I'm pretty sure leads to unlocking the unlimited flamethrower, um, another secret weapon. Um, using these secret weapons lowers your score at the end of the game, so if you're looking for a good score, I recommend not using them. Anyway, I don't need the map, because I'm not going to fucking bother playing the game all over again. Because I kind of want to get into Portal 2 next. Because that's what I'm going to be playing. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just laughing at this. <laughs> oh my god. Why? Why did they add it in? Oh my god. I forgot how great it was. Okay, um, here we go. What a weird doorknob. I bet I could, oof, take it off. Got the beam saber. 
Let's let's equip it. Yeah, shining sword. <laughs> it's a fucking lightsaber. Um, contrary to popular belief, this is not supposed to be an homage to uh, Star Wars. It's actually supposed to be an homage to um. Uh, I don't remember what it's called. It's some sort of TV show. Let's just test it out. Haha, <laughs> killed you. Anyway, yeah, so... Thanks for watching this weird bonus episode where I'm showing off weird... Um... Bloody... Bonus weapons. <laughs> so, yeah. Well, weird bonus weapons and weird bonus outfit. So yeah, thanks for watching, and stay tuned for my next Let's Play, which should be Portal 2. So yeah, thanks for watching, peace out. Bye! Fuck ye! Don't bitch slap your mother. You little fucking bitch. Don't you bitch slap me, I give birth to you. I free you up. <laughs> That's, <laughs> That's actually disgusting to think about, ew. No! Bad! <laughs>